You know that terrible moment when you're scrolling through your YouTube subscriptions feed and you realize that there's no new channels that you're excited about? You've run out of YouTube videos to watch? I'm about to fix that for you. I'm gonna give you 10 up and coming vegan YouTube channels that I love to watch that I think more need more recognition and views and subs because they're really awesome. First channel, you should check out if you haven't already, Thought for Food TV. They're the new king of vlogs. I take off my hat, I surrender Thought for Food TV. You are now the king of the vegan vlog. Jackson Long, my buddy from Colorado, he's been on my podcast, I've been on his podcast, Thought for Food, um, and they, uh, him and Aaron, his uh, co-partner, who's also my friend, they're just making incredible content from their podcast, but really their YouTube channel. They're busting out consistent vlogs. Jackson lives in Colorado. I get to, his, his name is also Jackson. Um, I get to sort of live vicariously again in the mountains through him. And he's also a, he used to be a competitive cyclist and he's a vegan, so he knows so much about sport and uh, cycling. And so he has tons of good information, tons of recipes, and they're just goddamn entertaining. So go check out Thought for Food. They deserve a lot of new views. Next is Ness Dot. Ness, uh, I met her in, well I met her in LA and then I met her in Thailand. She's another person that just puts out so much content and exciting content. Um, she works with Freely, the banana girl. So it's exciting to see when, you know, Freely comes into her videos and Ness is just really passionate. She cares about the uh, movement. She's definitely an animal rights activist. She's in it for all the right reasons. And she posts very consistently on her YouTube channel, um, vlogs, but also just uh, advice and recipes. She's also Australian and it's great to get some new accents in your life. Next is Mindful Diabetic Robbie, my buddy Robbie Barbero. He needs he needs no help here, but I just want to shout him out because he's been posting more on YouTube versus his main platform, which is Instagram. And he also does um, uh, consulting and retreats for people with diabetes that want to learn how to eat a raw fruit-based diet, which he's been doing for like over 10 years. Uh, he's an extremely inspirational guy, knows more about like health and science of a raw food diet than like anybody I know. And it's always fun to see his epic fruit rack, always more epic than mine or pretty much anyone I know because he knows fruit better than anyone. He used to work at Forks Over Knives. He really helped like build that business and he has since left Forks Over Knives and now just works uh, for his own uh, mindful diabetic Robbie helping people with diabetes and he's definitely getting more on YouTube so go check him out. Next is Vegan Vlogs. Vegan Vlogs, my buddy Hayden, I met him at the Woodstock Fruit Festival. He is also a pretty epic vlogger. He just moved from Texas to Puerto Rico and he's living like in the jungle and he shows all of the like tropical fruit fruits that I've never even heard of and he like opens them up and shows you the camera and eats them and gives like a flavor profile and he also just vlogs out in the jungle. So it's very, very exotic and really cool and it's just a way to sort of live the traveler exciting life while I'm here working. And I really just appreciate Hayden's uh, consistency. I think he's on vlog 200 and something, one of the most like consistent uploaders uh, of this whole list. So definitely go check out vegan vlogs. and. What a name. Next is Maddie Lim Burner. I met her um, in Thailand this summer. She's really great. She's that uh, kind of pick me up energy, always uh, happy uh, type of um, YouTuber. And she does a lot of like oil free recipes, vlogging. She also lives a pretty exciting traveler lifestyle with her boyfriend, Kyle. She's into cycling, talks about body image, talks about real stuff. So go check her out. She's also like the what I eat in a day queen. Next, my boy Drew Likes Rice. Drew Likes Rice is like one of the, just the funniest dudes that's a friend of mine who I've never met in person that I just can't wait to meet. He is, he's very funny. Um, he is, he's just no bullshit. He tells it as it is. He vlogs sometimes, but also puts out a lot of like eating challenge videos. He just does things crazy. If you want a good laugh and follow a very like spunky, high energy, young vegan person, he's also a college student. Um, he gives a lot of tips and advice. It's also just super entertaining and goofy. Sorry, Drew, I'm not trying to pick fun at you. I just think you're, you're awesome and you're hilarious. He did like the 10,000 calorie challenge just with white rice. Like who does that? 
My friend Alyssa Galkov, Russian vegan. Well, I mean, she's Russian, but she lives in Canada. Um, she has a great YouTube channel. Um, I think her latest video is an interview with myself from the Woodstock Fruit Festival. Um, so go check her out. She's a great video called Why I'm Vegan, and she put a lot of effort into really like summarizing what veganism means to her, and it really just like just just stuck with me. And I feel like if everyone watched that video, they would realize that veganism is within every one. So that's why I love her channel. And she's also probably the youngest person out of this whole list. And that just gives me so much hope for the future and for the world that like, you know, high school students like Alyssa are putting out really meaningful content around animal rights, health, and veganism. Next, we got Mastering Freedom. My buddy uh, Nick from Hawaii. Mastering Freedom. How do you get that YouTube channel name? Um, it is a very new YouTube channel. So far, he's pretty much done interviews with people. And if you want a YouTube channel that is really about um, thought-provoking mindfulness practice, meditation, just mastering, you know, having a calm and fulfilling life. Nick is just right to the point and getting getting in depth, getting deep uh, with the, you know, the real long-term results of being a happy, mindful, spiritual, vegan person. He's the guy to go check out. Next, Direct Action Everywhere. This is the first YouTube channel that's not just like kind of one specific person. DXE is the activist group that I'm a part of here in Berkeley, although they have branches all over the country and possibly over the world. I'm actually headed to a protest right after filming this video uh, on behalf of Thanksgiving, on behalf of the turkeys that are being uh, slaughtered and murdered for this terrible holiday, but that's for another video. Direct Action Everywhere is your kind of one-stop shop for animal cruelty footage, and you may be saying, why would I ever want that? I understand a lot of vegans don't need to see that, but it's a really, really powerful and useful source. They put together short videos that are very inspirational. Um, even though they're sad, they they show content of them actually going into uh, factory farms and rescuing animals. So. It's heart-wrenching, some of their videos, um, and you can, they're a great channel to kind of send to your friends and family who are interested in learning about veganism, and I have expressed that, but haven't fully made the plunge. You know, Direct Action Everywhere is a great way to kind of get right to their hearts for people that are teetering on the fence. And last but not least, my friend Tara Kemp. Uh, she is the brightest energy and happy, athletic, awesome person. I relate to her in a lot of ways. We struggle with um, some eating disorder pass, exercise addiction, and I feel like we also eat a very similar diet. So I feel connected with Tara. We met this summer at the Woodstock Fruit Festival and had a great time. She lives a pretty adventurous lifestyle, kind of just meanders through life and you know rides the waves of whatever interests her, and I appreciate that. She's also good at what she does. Since the beginning of her YouTube channel, the content has been high quality, so I know it's only gonna get better, and that makes me excited. She also hasn't been posting enough, so this is a call to action to go follow her and pressure her her to make more videos because I know there's some really good quality content under there. She's just got to get it done and post. Okay, there's so many more channels that I could talk about. Honestly, I, I watch a lot more up and coming YouTube channels that I didn't mention. So if you like this kind of video, if you want to learn about more channels, please give this video a thumbs up. Uh, also, let me know in the comments of any channels that I didn't mention that I should go check out. Subscribe to my channel, of course, to help this move in and to help my channel grow. Might as well. You can check me out on all my different platforms. Plantriotic podcast on iTunes and my website plantriotic.com. I'm also on Snapchat, uh, Instagram, all at plantriotic, and I'm on YouNow a few times a week. So I advertise when I'm gonna do my YouNow broadcast through my like Insta story and Snapchat. So go follow me over there. I usually let you know at the beginning of the day if I'm gonna do a YouNow live chat live stream that night, and those are so fun to actually connect with you guys and answer your questions right as you chat with me. Much love, Dream Extreme. I'm gonna go. Protest.